competitors leaving the assembly area for their Formula Junior practice session. This is practice four on the programme. And a total of some 19 competitors coming out for practice. And they're being greeted to dry, warm, sunny conditions. Number 46 is Andrew Spence in the 200. He was fifth fastest overall with a time of 57.956. That's a speed of 83.85. Number 24 is the South African driver Richard Daggett in the Scorpion. And the next driver coming into the picture is 47 Martin Walford in Phoebe Rolt's 200. He was fastest in practice with a time of 54.749, a speed of 88.76. Number 33, that's David Bain in the 200. Twenty-nine coming into the pitch, and that's William Grimshaw in the Moorland. William was fourth fastest overall with a time of 57.932. That's a speed of 83.85. As well as uh, commemorating the 50th year of the Elva, this uh, Formula Junior race is also a recreation of the first ever Formula Junior race in this country at Brands Hatch back in August 1959. When uh, Ian Raby's Moreland took on the the elders of Peter Pillsworth and Scott Blur. Ian Raby went on to win the Formula Junior race that day in the Moorland from the two elders. And that particular Moorland is being driven again today by William Grimshaw. So maybe history to repeat itself, who knows. It's Martin Walford in the lead from a fast starting Mark Woodhouse. Then it's Chris Drake, Andrew Spence. Crispian Besley, William Grimshaw back down in sixth after a very tardy start. Number 24 is Richard Daggett in the Scorpion. End of the first lap for Martin Walford, Mark Woodhouse, Andrew Spence, Chris Drake, Crispian Besley, William Grimshaw. There's Duncan going through there. Second lap into the Asses for the leader, Martin Walford, followed closely through by Mark Woodhouse having a good drive. Here's the mid-order runners, that's Grant Stephen, David Bain, Bernard Brock, Rob Manger and John Tweedale. After two races and a small shower, a small field of cars came out for the sports car race on a greasy track. At the start, Matthew Watts got the jump on Simon Hadfield, but by lap four, Simon Hadfield had the Mark 8 in the lead from Matthew Watts in the Mark 7S. The dice developed for third place between the Mark 4 of Simon Peach and the Mark 7 of Dion Kramer, Dion even having time for a quick spin at the S's. A number of Elba couriers took part in the race, including 66 Peter Barnard and number one Bing Boston.